Madonna Miriam? Yeah. SUP! Laura! Blumpy! Hello. Where is everyone? I guess people forgot about me. <laughs> uh oh. I might have to move. I don't know if this is private property or not. I'm kind of confused. Like, um... Okay, so I'm in this little driveway. And then there's a fence that says no trespassing. So does that mean no trespassing before the fence or after? Hi! Oh my gosh, it's too fast. Hi, everyone. I'm kind of nervous and overwhelmed, so... And I have to let a little chin free. I can't... I feel claustrophobic. <sighs> Hi! I don't even know where to start. Like, I'm gone seven days. and my, Or eight days, or however many days. And my life has, like, changed so much that I don't even know where to start. I have so many stories I wanted to tell you guys. I'm like, when something happens in my life, I'm like, I have to tell them this. Like, being away made me realize, like, you guys are my support system. Hi, everybody! <laughs> Welcome to Lam. Hello, everybody. I need to let a little bit of my chin out. Well, yeah, I'm in the Kia! No, Salah, let me take the... It doesn't... Does the Kia look like... No, it's not white. Hi! Hi, everybody! I missed so many people to say hi, so I'm just going to say a collective hi. I am literally jet lagged i know people laugh and use that as like a, a euphemism for being high no holy crap that's creepy i'm just like literally so tired and my body is so battered from this trip i am going nuts <sighs> yeah have new glasses so you know i did the prescription right like i went to the eye doctor last time i was in canada but then I left without getting glasses. They're super expensive here. So before I left, Salah was like, give me your prescription for your glasses. I'm going to go and get you glasses. And I was like, no, we don't need thanks everybody <laughs> for the birthday wishes and everything. Welcome. I'm like, we, you know, we don't, that's not a priority. <laughs> and even though I'm driving, yeah, I, uh, it's much better. I, I'm like, why haven't I gotten these sooner? So he went and got glasses for me before I headed out. And I'm glad he did. They're still pricey over there though. Hi guys! I just uh this the key is all set. It got has new brakes, has like two thousand dollars worth of work on this baby. I feel like I'm in a new car. I love this Kia. Let's never fight. Anyways, alright, so hi! I missed all you guys. Sorry, I missed like all everybody. Hey, Mary and Hexy, hey, how you doing? Brittany, everyone I missed, all the Beezers. Did I miss everyone who is in? Sorry, hello, I missed you guys. Um, thank you. Happy belated. Um, no name. Happy belated. <laughs> thank you. No name. <laughs> thank you. Jumping right in there. Thanks. I look cute. No, I don't feel it. Hi. Okay. Um, I have so much to talk about. House bees. Hexy, I know. Okay. So am I in a private spot? All right, you were so worried. Well, let me tell you what happened. So, thank you guys. Everybody, who did I miss? I missed a lot of, I think I missed some beezers here. My nose is dry. Hi. Thanks guys for, uh, it's going so fast. Joey, um, ghost face. Uh, I get nervous. Like, is this your property? People driving by. Anyway, they come and say, you know. Yeah, this is a new dress. Like, the minute I decided to come back to Canada, I was like, I'm going on Penningtons.com. All right, let's get some clothes because, like, I need Canada clothes, you know. So, this is like a dress, but it's so cool. It's going to be nice and cool. Cassidy, happy belated birthday. Missed your lives. Thank you so much, Cassidy. That's so sweet of you. Heather, Golden Girl. Hi, oh, thank you. Comic Brook, Flowers, Bonnie. Hi, Comic Brook. Boo Boo. Yeah, I'm going to show you guys all the new clothes. You know it. I'm going to wear them obsessively. For... Anyways, okay. So I got a strike on my channel. <laughs> and uh, at first I was like, what the F? You know, I was like pissed off. I was like, I have a strike on my... Rosemary. Hi, Marbles. Kayla. Trixie, loyalty beezer, thank you. Ready, start, rebees. 
<laughs> okay, sorry, I have to concentrate. Sorry. Hi, Caroline. I never have I ever. Paul Freed, everybody. Normally, Mimi. Shelly, I know. Okay, listen. <laughs> so, basically, um, and I was like, what? what? You know? But then, like, I saw, like, the post that I made. Like, I deleted it, but it's about the post. It was for the post that, thanks, mistress, Georgia girl, that I made about that Kalani lady. So, at first I was mad and I'm like, I'm like, you know what? It doesn't matter. Like, because I was responding to, I was triggered as usual, but that's my problem to be triggered. But anyway, I was triggered because I saw parts of a video on your mama's live stream about her. And she was like, you know, calling me heifer and that my husband wouldn't touch me. So I, you know, said some nasty things back. So, but you know what? It doesn't matter. I got caught for it. I think it's weird that, you know, that YouTube doesn't, you know, keep the same energy for some other channels that swear and all that but what I said was really nasty so you know what I'm like fine I, what I did was wrong I'll take the hit I'll take the L and you know what I think it's a sign from God or from whatever the universe whatever you want to believe that I needed that break like this break has been amazing for me and I know that's going to annoy you and it's going to make people mad but it was so amazing but yeah, I just want to sit and chat here for a while. <sighs> you thought I fell into the drain. So anyways, basically the, the, the break was awesome, you know? So yeah, I was like, yeah, you know what? I was nasty. Like, doesn't matter if I'm being nasty back, whatever. I'm like, I'm the, my point is like, I need to just ignore these people and really just bees focus on beesing, focus on, and I missed you guys so much. Like, you guys are my support system. I realize that in a lot of ways. Like, I have to just try to make it in a healthy in a healthy way. Like, um, so yeah, I have to be positive because you know what? YouTube is a popularity contest. A lot of people don't like me. So any little way they can, obviously, they're going to report me, right? Especially if I do something that um, goes against terms of service. And if I get caught, that's like, is it worth risking my entire channel for going after every little like people who are saying like that I'm a pig you know like no I needed to check my behavior it's like ruining my mental health everything so basically this this break was amazing and I made a very big decision to um move back to, to Canada and honestly if I had my way and I was rich I would probably bounce back and forth all the time no you're not you know what I wouldn't this journey <laughs> let me tell you this one of the stories okay I want to tell you one of the stories of the horrors of being on the plane this time. All right. So normally, sorry, I'm just getting this out and I'll talk to you guys and save your questions if you want to. But I normally fly with Qatar Airways or Emirates. I, I know I'm like, I only fly with Qatar. No, but there's a reason. All right. This time I decided, you know what? Okay. If I go with Qatar or Emirates, I'm on the plane for 13 hours straight. Because the transfer is only an hour of flight in Qatar. Way to Qatar, then 13 hours. Canada, Montreal. But if I try a different route, where Lufthansa, which is a German airline, I booked, I, I, so I, I went from Kuwait to Frankfurt on Lufthansa. Then I had an almost three hour layover in Frankfurt. And then I had to, hi guys, <laughs> um, not flare. <laughs> Air Canada, but they were both Airbus A330s, which, you know, they're not the Boeing Max. So I was just happy about that. So then, um, basically I thought, okay, I'm going to break it in half. It's not as bad. My body won't be as bad or, oh, I didn't like Lufthansa. Oh my gosh. It's not terrible. Okay. But like, I found the staff was not that friendly. They were more snappy. Um, the food was okay. Here's the food. Okay. So on the first flight, they gave me, they give you a sandwich. It's like this long. Okay. Nikki, move back permanently. Sala, Sala following you. Okay. Hi, Lee, Lee, one. I'll tell you guys in just one second. Okay. And then I'll check the comments. I have to get this out. <laughs> so yeah, guitar is super nice. Um, basically, um, what was I going to say? They give you a sandwich and it's their vegetarian sandwich, vegetarian sandwich. 
And so I'm like, okay, like literally that's how the attendant talked, a vegetarian sandwich. So I took it and um, it had cream cheese, okay? The cream cheese, I don't know, mess with my gut. So that's digesting. By the time I get to the second leg of my, you know, the Air Canada, I'm like, please don't let anyone sit beside me. Please don't let anyone sit beside me. And, uh, and I, like, I was literally praying, like, please don't let anyone sit beside me, Allah, please. Well, this guy comes bouncing down the, wa the, the, the walkway, sits right beside me, and he's listening to super loud music, like dance hall music. I don't know if you know what dance hall is. I'm so sure someone is. Anyway, he sits down and, okay, whatever. I, I slept most of the flight. He ordered wine. You get like complimentary little bottles of wine on Air Canada. He ordered wine and he spilt red wine on my clothes twice. So I smelt like a bottle of booze. I have to let out some chin. Sorry. Okay. So by the way, you guys don't have to delete me messages. Just let people talk, but only like really hateful racist stuff. You know what I mean? Okay. So, um, I'll get to, I have a lot to talk about, so I need to get it out. What was I going to say? So I'm not even really looking at the comments right now, so they can just go with talk if you want. I don't care. All right. So um, that's when the sandwich starts hurting my stomach. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, it's gurgling. For some reason, the cream cheese or something in that sandwich gave me the ultimate gas. It was the probably the worst gas attack I ever had in my life. And we're like, the the captain was like, okay, we have 20 minutes left till landing. Because, you know, landing is a whole process. They got to go down, 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 down. So there's like a gaggle of geese having an orgy in the background and I'm freaking out. Listen. Yep. Anyways. And I'm like, okay, I can hold it. Cause I'm not about to go. Cause you know, when you're landing, they say, okay, the lock, the, the bathrooms are going to be locked. So I couldn't go. I had to go. Like I had to go number two. I had to go. You know what I mean? And I, and I have no gallbladder. So I'm like, well, we'll wait for landing. So we land, and then you know how you have to wait to deplane? Okay. Chantel's Red Wing. I'm shook, Chantel. I ain't even mad. Welcome home. Thank you! Thanks, guys. Okay, let me get this out. Sam broke up his life. We win, Chantel. Ha ha. We told you so. You told me what? I don't even get what. Is that a, Oh, that's a hate comment? Oh, that's okay. You don't have to delete that. I don't care what they say. Okay, listen. It takes forever to deplane. The, everyone's just standing there, like, waiting for them to, to open the door. And I'm like, yes, I'm going to get to go. I'm, like, clenching hard. I need to go. Then we're all standing up. I go, go grab my luggage from the overhead bin. And the guy's like, okay, everyone sit back down because immigration is coming on board. And I was like, what? No, no, they're going to, like, investigate people. Why do you have to hold up the whole plane to investigate one person trying to get into Canada? You know? And, like, I'm like, oh, no, I can't make it. I'm so sick from this sandwich. And, like, oh, my gosh. I couldn't hold it. I was, like, I couldn't hold Like, I'm like, I can't. Anyway, somehow, miraculously, I did. They checked our passports. Like, they checked everyone's passports. So, that's the story on that. So, now, being in Canada... Hi, everybody. Nice to see you. Sorry I didn't look at the comments, really. Um, I'm moving here. Um, I can't stand the summer in Kuwait. It's bad for my health. Um, I need free health care because even no matter what my visa status would be there, I don't want to talk about that, but it would be expensive. So just think of, make whatever you want of that. If you want to think that I have this visa, that visa, it doesn't matter. It's okay. Fine. Whatever. But it is expensive. <laughs> just say that. Okay. So, um, I'm not divorced. I'm still with Salah. I'm taking things day by day and letting, leaving, honestly, this, I know you're going to think it's cringe, but I'm leaving it up to God. Like, I'm just going to control what I can control in my life and not worry so much so like because like honestly when i'm dead the anxiety that what i'm worried about won't matter you know i'll be like <laughs> honestly when you i don't know i just i have to worry about myself 
Nikki P. Browning, are you going to move in with peace? I hope you have help. Thank you. I'm not sure what I'm doing at all. Like, I am definitely getting an apartment. Like, I, I need to get my own setup here. So I need to set up everything, which means I have to, like, get everything from scratch. Like, I'm not rich. Like, I, we are okay. Like, we do fine. Like, we were able to, like, you know, everything. Fix the car. Um, get me here, which was, like, crazy. Um... It was a cheaper though on those two flights, but I I'm never going to compromise this. I can't. It's too... Air Canada is really good though. Air Canada. The only thing is they don't have personalized vents. I was almost dying. Um, I'm also getting Sam back. <laughs> like, I'm getting Sam back when I get my place. The foster lady... Um, She's like, after all, she had a cat before Sam, an older cat, and he doesn't really like Sam. I thought they were getting along, but no. Are you worried about celebrities? Thank you, Jessica. You know what? No, I'm not worried about, I'm not going to worry about that. Like, I have my trust in renewed trust. I said I would do it, like, trust, like, and, you know, like, I'm just going to live life. Like, whatever happens, happens. You know, I'm not going to stress about that. I'm not going to. I, there's nothing I can do. I don't have a, I'm not a fly on the wall over there. I can't live my life distrusting somebody, you know, like I can't waste that energy. Um, if I ever learn of something that's different, I'll deal with it, but I'm not gonna, no, I'm going to focus on myself. Um, yeah, I just, there's a lot of things I, I miss, like that I didn't think I would ever miss when I first moved to Kuwait. And when I got here, I was like very patriotic. I was like, Canada. But a lot of people on the plane were looking out and they were like, you could tell they missed Canada. Like you get homesick, but I also, now I miss Kuwait a lot too. Because when you're, you ingrain yourself in a culture for a year and a half or however long I was there, it's like, you know, and my, I miss Julia and Harry so bad. Like that's like, no matter which country I'm in, I have heartbreak because I miss my cats here. And then I miss Julia, like her little face and her fishy breath. Ooh. But... Salah is a good cat dad. I don't want to leave him. Like he genuinely, genuinely looks sad at the thought of leaving Julia. Hi, Squeaky. Yeah, Sarah Jean. Hi, Brittany Ghostface. Inshallah, he can come here. Yeah. No, I'm not here to renew my visa. He hated animals that move. He used to, Half Light. He used to. He was not an animal person. He was not raised with pets. He could care less about them before. He didn't hate them. Like, you know, he wouldn't hurt anything, but he fell in love with Julia. In love. Like, there's not he about about 15 times a day. I oh I can come like, are you harassing the cat again? Because he grabs her and holds her and just kisses her for like five minutes straight. And she doesn't persist, but she you, you know how cats look whenever you hold them? They're like, Do you hear the geese? Anyways, <sighs> dispensary time for wheelchair bees. I can't blank it. Um, yes, of course I miss him <laughs> all the time. Yeah, no, Ramadan's not over. I didn't have to fast while I was traveling. Um, and yeah, I don't know. I haven't really been doing that right now. Um, but yeah, what do you have questions about? C creepy comfort and crime! Thank you! Oh yeah, I can like the comments. Welcome back, you've been missed. Oh, thanks, I'm glad you guys missed me. Nicolina, I did, f I let it go on the plane so bad I couldn't hold it. It was like, like a machine gun with mixed with a tuba. <laughs> I'm religious, so I don't care. Here's the thing, there's religion and there's culture, okay? I'm Canadian, like, blood-wise, and we believe in the medicinal power of marijuana. So that's something I'm going to consider because, um, you know, I know it would be frowned upon by most Muslim people. But for me, it's like, I don't know, it's like medicine for me. I feel like having, like, a night when I get home, like, whenever, you know... You, you do your whole day, be productive, and then later at night for a treat, like, to relax. It's like medicine. Look, it helps with, like, you know, 
the CBD in that can help with pain. I can't take too many more NSAIDs. Like, my stomach is going to have a hole, like, this big inside it. You know? So. But I'm still Muslim. I still believe in, in God. And, like, how can I, you know, how can I just automatically... I, you know what? You can stop believing. People switch all the time. People go through struggle, you know? I think religion is something very personal, you know? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Sabriana! Glad you were okay. Was worried your mouth got you in trouble. Be safe and not talk personal business online or speak ill of others. You're right. Thank you. Thanks for the super chat. Nikki B. Knowing. We like honesty. Less hate when you're being real. Thank you. Thank you. You guys, I know you guys are all happy because, like, this is the land of the bees. For the land of the bees. Oh, no, that's the American. The geese is getting on my nerves. Anyways, I was thinking as a celebration, let's go eat somewhere. But I'm going to come back live when I get there because <laughs> you know the rules. Rosemary, I look happier. But what you said was true. What did I say? Hi, Rebe! Hi, everybody! Who did I miss? Rebe, because of chronic pain. Yeah, Babs, up to me, it's like medicine, you know? Sushi! Jessica, your, your, your channel's been blowing up, huh? Yeah, thanks, Golden Girl. Lolo, everybody, crab legs. Child, Carol chimes. Our home in Beezing land! <laughs> what did you say? Oh, Canada, our home in Beezing land! True home of the bees. Imagine I'm getting King Beezer back. And I'll never leave him again. Pretty soon he'll be strumming on a new counter. I can't go back to Kuwait, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, no name. Sham. Kuwait. Look, I love Kuwait. And I do miss Salah, like, a lot. It's so hard being in a long-distance marriage and for who who knows how long. But this is, like, a sacrifice I have to make. And it will be a true test of our relationship, too, because, you know, like, that long of distance? No. We'll see. You know, and I, I'm here to, like, also, I have to work on myself, but I need a plan. So on the 18th, I have, like, a um, therapy session. But I'm, like, starting immediately because I have help from my family to, like, you know, help me get in places and stuff. Um, my makeup, I don't have a lot on. Can we go in the handbag? I missed <laughs> Down under. <laughs> um, yeah, soon. Sometime soon, yeah. I guess, of course, I miss him. And I don't want to shit talk him. Like, that's the only thing I ask. Let's just not talk about him. You can have your opinions, but just keep them to yourself. Like, you know, just he is my husband. And, you know, it's important for me. Like, a little bit of respect for that. Lolo, 34 months. Girl, I knew it. Felt you were back. I'm glad you were taking care of you. Thank you. Ready, set, repeat. But we're just going to be. Thank you so much, Lolo. We're going to be. um, Yeah, someday he can visit. But. Like, for now, I'm just, fo I have to focus on me and, you know, beezing. <laughs> He's going to take care of the pets. Don't worry about them. He's taking really good care of them. And I, like, talk to him every day, you know, on video to see, okay, this is the pet situation, you know. Hi, Tracy! Yeah. Because uh, what do I miss about him? Everything. Like, just having that person there with you. Like, I feel lonely. I feel lonely and blue. <laughs> Whoa! 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 <laughs> Hold on! I feel lonely and blue. I won't torture you. Without you, baby, without you. I can't. Oh, you know what I was listening to when I was putting my makeup on? I feel like I'm living out my car. Maybe I am. Ah! Oh. You know that song? I want my MTV. My nose hairs. And that's the way you do it. Play the guitar on the MTV. I'm hyper as hell. <sighs> yeah, addressing my health. I can't stand the summer there. <laughs> um. Uh, 
I would just be in all the time, you know, in the summer, it's worse. I'm going to be in, I cannot go outside. I will die there in the summer. So glad you're not one with the sea. Nikki P. Thanks, Nikki P. Yeah, it's normal to have time apart. Thanks, Melly, Lisa P. So, um, what was I going to say? Applebee's, twisty, misty. Yes, we're going to do all those things. Just give me time. I want to go eat somewhere. Let's go fight some people at the DQ. How should we start the fight, Hexy? Thanks, Marvels. No, they don't have Nashies right now. I'm disappointed. Honky, uh, <laughs> haunted places. Yes. Harvey's. I got a bunch of things. Cheryl Pennington's from Pennington's. <laughs> Cash up what? Yeah. Um, orange tulip. So I have to go thrift shopping or something for all new house stuff. Dollar Tree has plates and things. <sighs> Yo, mom is stuck on a roller coaster? Agathon, what's up? Sam, Sam, Paneer. Hey, Tracy! How are you doing? Throw a handful of ice cream? No, I don't want to go to jail. Hi, Jenna! Thanks, Georgia girl. Do I have Cash App? I have PayPal. My PayPal for what? You guys are gonna um um what was I gonna say? I don't know. Thank you. We have tornadoes. No way. <laughs> so didn't help. Oh, house bees. St. Hubert. I saw that St. Hubert's has Nashville chicken tenders. <gasps> you know what would be so good? A chicken pot pie from St. Hubert's with a side of Nashville chicken tenders. <sighs> dispensary bees. <laughs> no. We can dispensary bees whenever I get my own place. You know, I'm just driving around right now, so a lot of driving, so I want to be more clear headed. I'm so tired. Well, uh, like, I have severe, like, I, I slept, like, went to bed at 11 and woke up at 6.45 a.m. Anyway, sorry about my TMI story about the plane, but it was, like, literally bad for me. And when we're in Frankfurt, my worst nightmare, my anxiety, the, the girl was like, okay, um, we have a situation, we have a full flight, full, the horror, biggest horror words ever, full flight. So they were asking people to volunteer to check in their um, carry-on luggage because we might not find room. And I was like... And then the, <laughs> the first plane, the guy I had to sit with was a very tiny man. Like, he was not... I'm not making fun of people of size, like, sm um, what do you, I don't know what you would say. You know, shorter people. I'm not making fun of them. But this guy, he wasn't, like, short, but he was really small and he had a full beard I don't know like <laughs> anyway um he was like can I sit here and I was like and I got mad <laughs> I was like yes you may um I'm just gonna go check if there's any other seats available <laughs> and there were none so I had to sit beside him but he was fine the good thing about sitting beside someone very small when you're fat is they have more room that you can encroach on <laughs> <sighs> Get a wheelchair right. No more wheelchairs. Those are too much. Honestly. Time for poop game round two. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. I, I, if it happens, it happens. I don't care. Whatever. I'm not going to worry my life about things. <laughs> Reginald, fill a deposit fund. You finally seem like yourself again. Missed you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, do you know how expensive it is to, like, start up again? So every little bit helps. Like, when your car breaks down, you have to move, and you have to travel internationally, and you have to buy things at the airport when you're traveling internationally, like a lot of fluids, which caught... Every time I would buy drinks at the airport, it was like 30 bucks. Yeah, no problem, no name. Uh, my living in my Kia, yes. <clears throat> Set the chin free. That's why I'm doing a little bit of the chin. 
I can reveal a little bit of the chin. My car, like, it wasn't broke. It just had a lot of wear and tear. It had a lot of things wrong. Like, not a lot of things wrong with it, but it needed a lot of maintenance, like regular maintenance, because it was, especially the brakes, they were, like, close to 2,000. I'm not getting, it was, like, all, okay, if I called a regular mechanic who's known to be, like, fair price, blah, 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 because they always say the dealership's scamming you. Well, this guy wasn't much cheaper. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go with the actual Ikea. Was it OEM parts or something? Like original Kia parts. And they guarantee their work. And Sorry, I need to clean. I need... We need to clean the Kia, man. So, yeah, that was insane. Okay, there we go. I cannot show my hair. No wife leaves her husband if you love him. Yeah, but I also love myself. So I'm here to work on myself. Anyways, that's our business, right? I don't, I can't pin my PayPal. Oh, you guys are sweet. You don't have to. But if you want to, my PayPal is. <laughs> I don't know how to pin. I'm on my phone. It's C. Okay, get ready to write it down if you want to. But you don't have to. But if you do, thank you. Okay, so it's C S A. R A. Is that my PayPal? E is that my PayPal email? Yeah, C S A R A at no. You know what? Just look up Foodie Beauty. PayPal dot me backslash Foodie Beauty. Yeah, that's what it is. Thank you, Miss Linda. Welcome home. Ready for supporting the new supporting the new Villa Glow Up? Yeah, I want to have like a bed rot bees era. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I'm j joking. Independent woman. That's the arc. Yeah docs <laughs> can't wait for the foodie videos yeah i miss honestly i do miss like my my content was i don't know my paypal's my hot okay my hotmail is c s a r a 084 at hotmail.com yeah c s a r a 084 at hotmail.com or paypal.me backslash foodie beauty or you can request a cameo and get your cameo now. Yeah. So I want to like, we have to Pennington's bees. We have to do all the beesing. Like in Kuwait, like, I liked living in a different culture and I liked, um, I, don't, I, I like, like both places. So it's like really hard for me. I feel very conflicted. Like, and I feel like an identity crisis a little bit. Yeah. The Greenwood. Go for a million. Yeah, Jack. Hi, Dawn. Welcome. <laughs> the Greenwood. Kuwait is the saddest. Like, why was it depressing for you guys? Just because you you guys are used to me having such an outgoing personality to being completely muted or what? <clears throat> That's what it was, right? Hi, Georgia girl. So that's good. No, I have not seen the new documentary on me. That was not me. Well, I think a lot of it is cultural. I don't think it's like haram to laugh at farts. But I could be wrong. I don't know. Have you seen sad? No, I was like happy there, but like, yeah. I feel like... I wanna break free. <laughs> I wanna break free and eat chicken pot pie with some nashies. No, I have to get healthy, but first I need to like have a celebration. <sighs> Admit it. Thank you, Charlene. Thank you guys for the birthday wishes. That was depressing. I miss driving. Like I love I was driving down the, the long road singing. I can see, see you. <laughs> the Boys of Summer song. I'm, I don't have any plans to go back to Kuwait. I don't have a return ticket. I'm getting a place here. Down Under, thank you for joining me. So we need a Beezer army again. So we can go marching into the bees. I tried my best. Thank you, Joey. These glasses. 
Maybe SUP someday. I don't know. I'm just taking it day by day now. <sighs> no, Widow too young. Kiana. Like, even if I... Like, taking off your hijab? No, I can't. I'm not doing that. <sighs> I want to come up with different hijab styles. Like, you know? I don't know how to explain it. Like a more Western hijab style. And when I'm over there, I dress in abayas and hijabs. Like, you know, when in Rome. <laughs> a bees means... Yeah, we can bees in a hijab. And I don't... I, I ate a non-halal chicken sandwich at the airport, by the way. I was so hungry! Because I was like... After, I didn't eat like anything on the plane, Air Canada, because of the fact that uh, my stomach was so bad. So by the time I did so much walking, my body feels so bad right now. Teardrop, hi! Glad you're safe. I was worried. Thank you, Teardrop. Sorry if I missed you when you came in. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, you can decide what being Muslim means to you. It's personal, exactly. There's no compulsion in Islam, like they say. You're not, you know, like certain things anyways. It doesn't even say in the Quran, you have to wear a hijab on your head. It's interpreted that way by scholars, but mostly what it is verbatim, it's like to cover, make like loose clothing so you can't see the form of your body. Like don't dress like what we would call skank dress, you know, which I used to do. Yeah, but I don't miss that. I like to be covered up. Honestly, I do. I, I, I'm 40. I want to kind of start dressing my age. Not that if you want to dress, you know, like that when, when you're 60, that's no problem. But for me, I think I like, you know, like this stuff. Like, I don't know. I want to go walking too, Ribby. Yeah. Reginald doll! My, the doll I was going to get for my birthday. Reggie said, please. Welcome. So, yeah. Thanks, Leslie. Hey, Brooke. Cumbersome. Welcome, cumbersome. Ready, set, ease. Ease. <laughs> Can we deity wig bees? <laughs> no. I don't even. Oh, no, I don't have my wig. Maybe. No. Thank you, Lin um, Linda. Yeah, my glasses are new. No wine. I'm not going to drink alcohol. But uh, no. Turbo Toots, welcome to Very Important Beezers. Peace. Hi, Glam Gal. Thank you, everybody. Michelle. I need to blow my nose. So I'm pretty much just going to bees around the bush. I'm going to take some pain meds. No, no. How many milligrams? Yeah, I can have one, one more pill. Because that's my brand is Foodie Beauty, you know? <sighs> is Incorporate a real person or AI? I don't know. I've never heard of them. Thanks for the super chat. Who's that? <laughs> Brittany, what's going on? Tangerine? Thank you. Nashy girl. I'm looking for my Kleenex. I was run out of Kuwait by the Islamic radicalists. No, I wasn't. They're not, there's no radicalists in Kuwait. Those are mostly in Syria, Afghanistan, Pakistan. Not the Gulf country. Maybe Saudi Arabia. No, I don't know. Sorry, sorry, I'm gross. <laughs> oh yeah, I was listening to so I was listening to the Dire Straits. I need to, and I can't go out to eat. My hijab is slipping. <laughs> Pakistan bees. <laughs> Hi, Miss Linda. Did it, Brenda? No. Pete's bees, please. He's working. What do you want for your birthday? I don't know. My birthday's over. <laughs> Fupa clap in solidarity with class. I would. <laughs> I 
I had a decent birthday. Hi, Ribby. Happy belated birthday. Thank you, Ribby. Thank you. I don't even care who's talking shit about me right now. I feel too, like, I don't know. Like, I don't know, happy. <laughs> Hi, Scrape Goat. Sister, I think you missed the answer prayer today. Oh, no. Thank you for the super chat. Yeah, I did, actually. But again, that's my personal business. I was doing a lot today. I was out. And I can't, I'm not doing it. Like, I can do it in my heart in public, but. Mike, remember for three months, happy belated birthday 40th. Thank you, Mike. Ready, set, rabies. <laughs> Thank you. Zoe, I got back to Canada yesterday. Yeah, I'm staying in Canada for good. We should do a Starbucks. <coughs> Boycotting, supposed to. Um, so yeah, just, I came back here, at, like, for many reasons. Like, there's just, I don't even know how to give one answer. So. Those pillows. What? Hi, Susie. I go back and forth. Do you know how many times I've made this trip? Like, what, six? I'll read my chat. Sorry, Brittany, what did I miss? So full of life, love the sun, rain down under shopping bees. Yeah, I'm still married. I'm so relieved when I come back here. Well, you know, while I'm here, yeah, like there's a relief, but at the same time, there's like a heartache a bit, you know. So, yeah. Oh, well, that's life. I want to be somebody. I want to be somebody, Billy. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Canada looks good on you. Mimi Pondu. <laughs> Let's go buy a mullet wig. Ready? Welcome to the first of Okay, let's, I'm going to go drive somewhere to have dinner and then... Whoa, no you don't. Oh, no you don't. The stupid thing. <laughs> I gotta lose weight. <sighs> Don't you fall. Circle in the sand. Yeah, teardrop. Yes, I'm getting Sam. And yes, I'm gonna take very good care of him. His nails are not gonna get too long. Chantel's trusty box. Yeah. Mall up. Yeah, that's true. Some of the abusers are coming back. Falls deep. You can dream on. I'd rather be dead. Can we go egg their house? Yeah, I have a video. Yeah, I filmed some of the journey. Yep. <clears throat> We're not over. No. Circle in the sand. Thank you, Brittany! Yeah, Sam is coming back. Yeah. My poor guy. There's a tractor coming. Hi. There's a tractor with a, a guy who's carrying a big piece of a tree. I didn't escape. Yes, of course. Let the farting begin. No. <laughs> I have been to Germany. Yeah. Not only the German, the uh, Frankfurt airport. I can't type in the, I can't type in the chat. It's not possible. For my PayPal. Unless someone wants to type it. It's C S A R A C Sara 084 at hotmail.com or paypal.me slash backslash uh, foodie beauty. <clears throat> yeah, Salah and I are fine. I'm, I didn't come here because um, 
anything to do with the relationship. I came here for, it's too hot Kuwait, I need health care, I miss driving, I miss beezing. And, uh, I want to take a stab at my career in yodeling. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> Julia, yeah, he's going to take care of Julia. Um, and he'll just bring her here, you know, or if he, if something happens and he can't, I will go back to Kuwait and get her and just feel, find out. Like, I'm overwhelmed with bringing, I am not healthy enough. Like, first of all, I can't have my own pet until I get my own place. So right, right then, where would she come right now? You know, second, I'm barely well enough to take myself on this freaking journey, stupid 17 and a half hour freaking travel day. Oh, I legit, like, I can't even tell you. You're so tired. I took a red eye. My flight was at 1.45 a.m. So, like, it was, like, you're tired already. And then when you start falling asleep, they turn on the lights. It's like, you get. we got to Frankfurt at, like, 6 something in the morning. I was so tired. Then you have to walk around a huge airport, wait in a huge line for security. And then like, it's just 18 hours. Yep. Cause he can't just come here. Like, you know, can't you drive with the camera pointing upward? Oh no, I can't do that. Something will happen. Welcome back. No name. We all miss you. Thank you. Sunflower. It's very hard leaving him. It's not easy. Chantal, the link is for the people they don't want to be attacked for supporting your channel. Oh, I get it. <laughs> Me personally, I don't care. No, I totally get that. Yeah. Can we get stoned tonight? When I get my own place, we can have like a I don't know, hamburgerized bees in no. <laughs> we can have like, you know, a hangout at nights. I can do like live streams like three times a day again. <laughs> Coffee bees, dinner bees, cooking bees, and night bees and Mario bees. <sighs> no, I'm too nervous driving in Kuwait. I still have the same old CPAP. Yeah, I'm going to get food, Cassidy. They have healthcare, but it's expensive for like certain things, you know, I was attacked and accused of being a troll. People don't know we've been friends for a while. Yeah, I heard that. No name. That's not cool. Anyways, um, I'm trying to think of what I want to eat. Where do I want to take you guys? What are we in the mood for? Asian, Indian, not Indian. St. Hubert's. <laughs> the pot pie. Did you bring your play button home? Hey, Brenda, thank you. Lock must. I brought my play button home because I'm going to have it. I'm going to send it back. And they're going to send me one that says Foodie Beauty. <laughs> because the Merriam one is damaged. Like, there was a dent in it. So they said if it's damaged, I can return it. They will send me a label. I return it. And then once they get it, they'll send me one back. I just waved at a farmer. <laughs> bought by yeah that's not halal though there's not much halal stuff here smash it with a hammer and get a new one inshallah <laughs> no i wouldn't do that i might roll down the hill yeah because i'm dressed modest i can do a modest hill rolling put in yeah Farm boy bees. Yum. Yum, farm boy. Mac and cheese. <laughs> I know. I thought Foodie Beauty was dead. 
Well, some parts. <laughs> but, you know. <sighs> Anyways. I'm just trying to be positive. Like, it is hard, you know. When I, like, sometimes I have to really try. Because I do, like... Anyway. I miss a lot of things, you know. Anyway. No, L5, I'm not. <laughs> it was happier I was home. A lot of people. Both, yeah. What are buffalo balls? Not right now, Jerry. Most people have to try to be positive. It doesn't come natural for everybody. Yeah, nothing like the Western world. I don't know. There's a lot of things I miss about the East, too. And there's things I miss even about Thailand. Like, every culture has its pros, you know? Yes, if, you know, if we were over, I would tell you guys if I felt like it, but stop telling her to eat trash food, yeah. I feel like eating, like, junk, though. No, I'm kidding. Just don't become a potty mouth. I have lots of bang language. No, I'm not going to, Melly, yeah. I don't think I will. Ah, no. <laughs> it's okay. Go be happy in both places. It's less okay to be unhappy. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, Canada has better gravy. Just breathe and take your time with everything. Yeah, exactly. Can we want it fast? Hi, Jessica. Just put us in your purse when you drive. Dude, That's I want to listen to music and things. Do they have fork salad in Canada? What? Hi, energy! Strawberry picking bees. Healthy meals only. Belinda's big five head. I'm so happy right now. Oh, that's mean! <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. Purse bees. Yeah, well, obviously they're going to be higher right now. I was gone for a while. You know. A lot of love and support here. That's another reason, too. Yeah. You know. I just felt like, what future do I have over there? I can't, like, in the summer, I can't go out. Like, I guess if I worked really hard, really hard, I guess making a future for myself, I need to be healthy, like, no matter what. But there, it was, like, a lot harder for me, you know? So I do have a lot more support here. Just want to bees. Let's drive to Orange Julep and bees. Are you kidding? I can't go live at Orange Julep. People are going to show up there. They know where that is. But thanks for the super chat. <laughs> I can get some dog spray. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> That's illegal. What are you even allowed to defend yourself with in Canada? It's illegal to have everything. It's like if someone's trying to kill you and you pepper spray them, you go to jail for the pepper spray and they go to jail for murder. But you still go to jail for the pepper spray. Thanks, Leslie. <laughs> So, I just, I feel, I can't be weird in public there. That's the only thing. <sighs> Thanks, Pamela. Get some bear spray. <laughs> Carry a butter knife. <laughs> hey, remember that, uh, the death of a cheerleader? The woman had a knife with her cucumbers in the car? Is that allowed? No. Evie's beauty. I couldn't, like, use an illegal weapon. No, that's my problem. I can't. I could never. Anyways, I'm just kidding. I would never do that. I'm not leaving the Kia. So if you come up to me, I'm just going to drive away. Bright neon screen. Hi, Vanessa. Putt putt. I don't pay the car payments. I know you guys think that, but I don't. So yes, I'll be fine. Do you hear this or is it just me? So, um, any other questions before I'm I'm gonna go live again where I get when I get to where I want to eat, I guess. 
I'll just say I'm on a. I'm not going to Akron. Oh, I'm not going to Ohio. I'm not going anywhere where pot is illegal ever again. Hi, Christina. Take your health seriously, please. I don't know. Anyway, sushi. Hey, Vanessa. I'm just back. Just for a lot of reasons. I'm just. I'm okay, but live your life. Yeah. Thanks, no name. I'm not planning on going to Kuwait right now, no. Anytime soon. Take us. I'm not going. I'm not doing that travel journey anymore. Like I, I can't do it. Like the thousands of dollars spent back and forth. Um. The 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 toll it takes on you mentally, like every minute. I'm just like, okay, just stay calm. Just stay calm. In every lineup, in every, like, ah. Uh, it was just a lot of walking. I'm not used to that. And, it, you know, in Germany airport, you can't ask for help. Like, I, I'm i like, is this shuttle? Is there, like, a shuttle service? Like, they're like, oh, ma'am, you have to pre-book that. It's, like, for people who are, like, disabled and you need to book it two days in advance. So I was like, okay. <sighs> I'm scared here. I gotta go. Hi, Sabre. Oh, it is Cheryl. How are you? Thanks, Evie's Beauty. I seem happier. I'm sad, though. I have a bidet. I took one with me. Salah got me one. <laughs> he thought of that, too. See, that's what I miss about him. He thinks of things that I don't think of. Anyway. I don't know. There's things that you'll you don't know and will never understand because I don't talk about it. But yeah. Everything else. Yeah, he is thoughtful, you know, in in a lot of ways. But day bees. <laughs> yeah, I brought brought a bidet with me. I hope I can install it. Like, I hear birds, but I can't see them. So, guys, you gave me a bidet. Yeah, we had an extra one. I don't remember why. Oh, I think we took the one because the old one at our old place was ours. I don't remember. Anyway. Yeah, Emma, he's, yeah, it's very different. Like, not just that, but... It's weird. I feel a bit lonely. But that's okay. I'm not gonna run keep running back. Like I have to like stick to my guns. Make an Amazon wish list for your new place. <laughs> Thanks for the super chat. Thank you. Thanks, Melly. <laughs> Sorry, my nose. That's not the plan, uh, Mimi Pondu. Hi Sula. Hope there's not a K Bella 2.0. Me too. Do you know how hard it is when you've been through something like that with someone to trust them when you're away? So obviously I'm dealing with that. But the thing is, is I'm not going to let it um ruin like my time, you know? And that's really hard for me because that's all I sometimes want to focus on. So I have to force myself to like be productive and distract myself with other things and get used to this new reality and it feels like I'm always getting used to a new reality and it's like really mentally hard you know like I, I make my life harder on myself <laughs> but yeah that um yeah so I mean you know Thanks, Faith Love Life. Yeah. I know, Chinny. I just don't want to talk about it. I just want to focus on positive things. 
<laughs> Electric boogaloo. <laughs> no, if I ever, if something ever happened and I had to be single again, I would stay that way. I don't have any emotional energy to invest in something. I just don't, I, I can't do it. I don't want to. I don't. So happy with just good people around me. That's platonic. Fine. That's fine with me. And the PM recipes. Yep. Just, I'm fine. I'm 40, you know. <laughs> I can't keep, not just age, I don't care. I, I can't keep doing it. My great grandfather fell in love at 89. Let's go to Farm Boy and use the bathroom. I <laughs> just want to be. Okay, I will do that eventually. Yeah, I am color purple. 100% and us. Thanks, guys. I don't look over 25. Yeah, right. Men need women. We don't need that. Mistress Von Dracula. Yeah, I don't. Paneer and root beer. No name. Keep things private, hun. Whatever will be, will be. You'll be okay. Yeah, thank you, no name. I appreciate that. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. I, out of respect for my relationship, because I know you, I want to address just this, that I know a lot of you can't comprehend how I could even, you know, ever forgive somebody, like forgive him for that or whatever. But like I said, I've evaluated on based on a lot of other things, good things in a relationship. And, um, you know, I made that decision. Um, that being said, um, you know, I'm also not go. I'm also taking care of myself and not gonna, like, I'm always, I always have my guard up in a way now, you know? So I also, um, just out of respect for my marriage, I don't want to talk about like very personal things about our relationship or about Salah. Um, you got, yeah, Jessica, you guys don't have to, like, you know, I know a lot of people, uh, bees are still like him and he is really good to me in a lot of ways. And, you know, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to like talk personally about our relationship. I didn't do that really with BB, right? I don't think so. Um, well, maybe a little bit about it's when things are about me and how I'm feeling, it's hard not to talk about that, you know? But take your time to settle in and just breathe. Thank you, Keena Bear. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. I'm single. That's awesome. Yeah. Thanks, Emma Pearl. Maybe. Thanks, Lily Mindfully. Thanks, Dawn. I'm glad you guys understand. Most OG Beezers do not. <laughs> well. Anyways. Yeah, I can't go through. I could never go through that again. No. These moonlight desires haunt me. They want me. <laughs> I was listening to that and singing and I realized I would be on a cringe compilation if anyone saw this. No, Adonis. Yes, let's go. Hey, Ariel. I want to go have dinner. I hope you change your mind. Hi, Melissa. Yeah, Grandma G, I am. I'm worlds away from my husband, yeah. So I'm, I'm sad about that. You know, because I really do love him, but I feel like I had to come back. But then whenever I get here, I'm so sad, and I miss Julia and Harry. You can't ever say goodbye enough, you know? But I hope I see her again someday. <laughs> you're having fajitas please money for a rescue mission she's fine with Salah for now he's the cat dad I feel bad whenever you have a pet you, who? how do you decide who has custody you know like when I when I moved out from Pete he kept Timbit and I kept the other cats like but this cat we got together and he grew very very close to her we both did we had our like nights every night he would be laying on the bed i'd be laying across the bed the other way and she would lay right at right by my head at his feet and we would watch a movie because i'm more comfortable when i watch a movie like laying this way and he's more comfortable this way 
Julia's like this. And she watches TV with us and like she yawns and she and her breast was like fishy moo. He is the best pet dad. Uh, I don't remember the name of the eyeliners from Amazon. I'll check. Yeah, teardrop. Hi, Abel and Maverick. Hi. <laughs> the pets are fine, Half Light. You're being dramatic for nothing. She's fine. I'm going to get her back. We grow through our experiences and the experience. If it continues or not, we'll make you grow and stronger. Traveling and getting. Yes, and getting into other cultures, like experiencing other cultures. Yeah. Exactly. Yes. Julia's fishy fish. <laughs> what? Having loved ones abroad is heartbreaking. I don't know if I want Chinese. What time is it? What about... Thanks, ABCDFG. Harry Howington. Yeah, I want to get Harry Howington back. I couldn't bring them right now. There's no way. There's just no way. Hi, Phoenix. Where would they stay until I get my place? No. Haley Henry, welcome to your first bees. Not pizza pizza. I want to go in somewhere and relax. <laughs> Carolina, yeah. Hi, Carrie. Carrie and Minnie. I know every time I eat Chinese, you're right, Jessica. I always complain about it. It's one of those things. Domino's, no. Putin, oh yeah, Putin, no. My face. Oh, he does, Millie. We we video chat. Yeah, okay, Brooke. Lachine well, Steakhouse, my ass. Um, yeah, Nia, but not today. I didn't. I haven't really been. I don't know. Like, if I take my meds without the pills, I don't know if I, like, I try fasting, but then, like, sometimes if I take my pills on, like, on an empty stomach, especially the pain ones, the, the NSAIDs or the, like, it just feels, oh, my God, it's the worst stomach pain. So I've learned that, no, if I'm going to take, if I need to take my pills, I have to eat something with it. Some pills you shouldn't take on an empty stomach. Wings, paneer. <laughs> Vietnamese. You're going to have Chinese known him? Yum. Baba gun. Ew. No way. No, not to that, but. Yeah, I'm in Canada. So, anyways. They have a new buffalo chicken wrap. Thrill -ho. Yeah, but I'm kind of having trouble not eating. <gasps> Chicken Parmesan! Okay, I'm going to go find somewhere and I'll come back. There's no bathroom around here. I gotta pee. Yeah, with the NSAIDs. Yeah, and my diet, like my Janumet, you have to eat with, take with food. I don't know. I think that's what the doctor said. <laughs> Thanks, hearty! I can't have bacon. Chicken parma noodles. Mall Chinese. Oh, mall Chinese. No, not mall. To go in a mall right now? Hi, Travonda. Be safe and keep positive catchy. Thank you, Mistress Von Dracula. Amber Chick. What? Oh. Yeah. I'm going to do my best, Bailey. Yes. Shanghai 360. I think they do. Do what the doc says. Yeah. Oh my god, shiny object. Hello. Lasagna. Yum. Cone dog. There's some halal Indian, Emma, but hibachi? Hibachi! Anyway, I'm going to go pick somewhere and I'll go live again when I'm there, okay? <laughs> yeah, thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Jamaican meat patties. The place is going to close. Rita's! Hello! We don't have a Sonic. Yella. Yes, I have planned on getting a doctor. You're excited? Rashetta. 
Yeah, you can get an ulcer, exactly. Watch your back to your job. Yeah, exactly. You should put a wig on your hijab as a disguise. Hi, Monica. Thank you. Hi, Louise. Thank you, Louise. Thank you, guys, everybody. Um, cheese and ham cheddars. What is that? I can't eat ham. If you're Muslim with health issues that require you to stay hydrated. I have to stay hydrated, yeah. The meds, if they don't take a lot of water with the genuine, they can cause... Hey, Caroline, they can cause um, kidney issues. Yeah, Lynn. Ulcers? I don't... Yeah. Mm. Beef and cheddar! <gasps> Peace is working. Eat ham as medicine. Ew. No thanks. Mac and cheese loaf. That has pork! I wish I had, could have that. It's my favorite deli meat. Arby's got the meats. Oh, I want to go in somewhere and eat. Like, just, you know. Okay, I'll go find somewhere and I'll come back. I'll be back, guys, so watch out. Lobster mac and cheese. You know when your thing digs in? Okay, bye. Bye.